If you've been watching the channel for a while, you may know that a while ago I did a whole series of duct tape mods, mostly around rough cuts. I thought I would collect up those short videos where I was living my red-green dream. Who's red-green? Just a Canadian icon. I really hope you like these goofy videos. And let me know if I should get the tape out again. I did four or five of these. I'll put chapter markers down below in case you get bored. And remember, if they don't find you handsome, they should at least find you handy. It went something like that. Hmm. A Maritime Foam Lab production, the Flip 64, a reality. After all the Flip 16 and Flip 32 and Flip 64 goofiness, one thing I have learned is that I love rough cuts and duct tape. Introducing the Rough Cut 180 Defense System, where you can fire forwards, you can fire backwards, you can flip it, you can turn it, you can peek through it, you can wear it. I'm going to use this. I like it. I'm going to be on the hunt for more rough cuts. Maybe I'll have a huge wheel of rough cuts. Who knows? The 180 in this one is more for the forward and back. It's 32 darts. I need to get 3D modeling. Start making some connectors. Until next time. Check out Family Foam Sport for his take on the flipping rough cuts and check out Foam Blasted. I needed a little more room. Introducing the Rough Blade. Times of great need, they unite into the double cut. Forged from broken X-shot blades of old. When united, this ultimate nerf weapon holds 16 darts, 16 more in storage, has two swords and can separate into two weapons. And it's 90 inches from blade to blade. I hope you enjoy these goofy projects as much as I do. If you do, please subscribe and hit that bell. This one's for Beans Dude, who on my last stream made the awesome suggestion of using two quadrots and making them into a pocket rough cut. And what is more on theme than duct taping zombie strike stuff together? We have this attached on the front. On the back, we have an old part of a gift card here so that when we pull back one, we pull back the other. But this one's free to go ahead first so we can shoot one at a time or both at once, just like a rough cut. On the trigger, there's several layers of plastic and some duct tape to keep it flexible so you can do one trigger or apply pressure and do both at once. This is actually pretty functional. I mean, it's a wide grip. It's not super comfortable, but I mean, come on. <laughs> Let me know what you think. Uh, let me know what else you want me to tape together because I'll do it. I got a full roll of tape and I don't sleep a whole lot. Wait though, is, is this a good idea? It must already be a thing. I need to make a connector. Hi, I'm Anthony Stewart with Maritime Foam. Working with Foam Blasted, we brought flip technology to a host of your favorite blasters. Inspired by duct taping four Nerf rough cuts to a Flip 32, this flip rail attachment designed for the rough cut slips onto the tactical rail 
And then, this product also works with hammer shots, quad rots, hey, a flip eight. And you can keep your eye on the target with the built-in sight. And who even says you have to flip it? We had a lot of fun making this. Tolerances vary from blaster to blaster. So if you're looking for one, we have physical ones available, or you can download the digital files. Happy flipping. The only limit is you. Available on Etsy from Maritime Foam.